fell in love with somebody who doesn't even know my name, know my name, no, no. And I know this, I'm ashamed. I'm, I'm not even going to start. I'm not even going to do my intro, bro. I'm going to just go straight into it. Now, you guys seen the clip. You, you guys seen the clip right there. Dude recording this chick. See, staring at her. Dude would even get up and go talk to the girl. Like, Really? And the dude saying, man, find her, man, find me, whatever, whatever it says. You know, giving a good stare at her and all that. But you didn't get up and go talk to her, bro? Like, what is this in today's generation? Social media has ruined the dating game. It, it, it ruined it. Social media ruined it. Like, if you wanted a girl... Back in the 70s, 80s, and 90s, you had to go up and talk to the girl. And in the early 2000s, too, you, you had to go up and talk to the girl. There wasn't no social media. I mean, social media. I'm sorry. I can't talk today. But there wasn't no social media back then. If you wanted the girl, if you wanted to talk to the girl, you actually had to go up in person, walk up to her, introduce yourself, have a conversation, and things go from there. But no, Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook have to come in the picture. Guys, if you see a girl, you're getting the goods that are her. If this girl, like, if this girl, if this girl finds you, if this girl finds you attractive, bro, and, and if you find her attractive, you need to walk up and talk to her. But nah, today, in today's generation, the simps, will, um, the beta male simps, they will see the girl in person, don't go up to them, and then be like, nah, bro, I got her Snapchat, I'll just test her later. And be like, hey, I saw you today. Like, what? You have to be kidding me. Hey, I saw you today at this party. And then the girl's gonna be thinking in her, in her head, well, why didn't you speak? Dummy, now you're in the friend zone because you're not confident. You're too nervous. I'm, I'm sorry. I need to. I, reason, reason I'm getting like this because I'm so passionate about uplifting my guys. I am tired of this. The dude recorded the girl, which is weird. Stared at her. Was smiling, all that. She was there, by, she was sitting at that table by herself. Walk up, be like, hey, how you doing? My name is, what's your name? Da -da 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 -da. Let me get your number. Set some up. You miss 100% of the shots that you don't take. Guys, basketball reference. You got the ball, you coming down the court, you're at the three-point line, you're wide open, Shoot it! Just like the dude should have shot his shot at that girl. Sitting by herself. Guys, be confident when you're talking to girls. If you're not, if you're anti-social kid, get out your comfort zone. You know, go find go find things that get out that get out your comfort zone that will make you talk to people. You know what I'm saying? If you're an anti-social kid, get out there. Get get out, get out the house and go, you know. Go have conversations with some people at your job. If you have a job, talk to talk to coworkers at your job to get to get out your comfort zone. If you're at school, talk to some classmates. Talk with a couple. Of, talk with some teachers. Cause you, cause if you're being an anti-social kid, man, and you see a girl come your way. And you be like, damn, bro. Go talk to her, bro. Get out your comfort zone. Grab, grab your nuts and go talk to her, bro. 
see how good you gonna, you gonna feel when you when you talk to the girl. Now two things is gonna happen. She either gonna reject it, she either gonna reject you or or mess with you. If she reject if she rejects you, bro, that's okay. There's feelings of girls out there. Don't don't stress over when that rejected you. Not every girl's gonna like you, bro. But just go up to her. If she's interested, she's gonna show it. If she's not, then she's not interested in you, bro. Just move on. Like, I can't, I can't stress this enough. If you want girls in your life, if you want to get girls, you need to be confident. You got to have confidence. You know, you, you got to have that swagger, man. Like, what do you not understand? You got to have swag. You got to run your game. You got to learn how to spit game. You know what I'm saying? But guys, don't be nervous. Be confident. That that's one of that's one of the few things a girl likes to see in a man. Is this guy confident? Because a girl is not gonna mess with you if you're not confident. Your body language shows it. Body language, your voice, all that. Make eye contact when you're talking to the girl. Have good body language. So that you're interested. Have a good conversation. If she doesn't want to have a conversation, just walk walk away. Guys, that's one that's one of the few things that girls are looking for is confidence in a guy. If you don't have that confidence, that's one of the reasons you're gonna struggle with girls. Because you don't have confidence. I am dead serious. Social media, bro, like, pulling girls on social media will be hard unless you have status, unless you're good looking, unless you, yeah, if you don't have status or or you post pictures of yourself and you're a good looking guy, you're getting likes from all these girls, you got girls commenting on your post, you're good. But if you're ugly and you don't have status and you thinking you can hit up every girl on social media, you're going to struggle because it doesn't work like that. You actually have to go up to them sometimes. Social media doesn't work for pulling girls every time, bro. Do, do, you, do you understand what I'm saying? Social media, social media ruined it. I'm serious. But um, yeah, that's all the points I covered. Hopefully, let me know if I left something out. Guys, if you see a girl, that you find attractive and she's by herself minding her own business go up to her i don't care if you have the groceries and look presentable when you when you go up to the girl first impression man make sure you have a haircut make sure your looks is on point nice clothes everything i don't care if it's at the grocery store i don't care if it's at if it's at the mall um I don't care if it's at the if, if it's if it's at the mall, grocery store, like Publix, Target, or the gym. You know, you getting your workout in. You going up to her, um, giving her giving her a little conversation, and then you go back to doing your workout. Dude, you would get out your comfort zone, and you'd be like, "Man, this is so easy, bro. I'm out my comfort zone, bro. You got to get out your comfort zone if you're gonna succeed with women, bro. All right." Well, um, that's the end of the video, man. I hope y'all took something from this, man. All right, hope y'all have a happy, hope y'all have a happy Halloween, cause tomorrow is November. Cold weather season is coming, you know what I'm saying? You know, daylight savings, you know. Oh, November, December, my favorite time of the year, you know what I'm saying? But I catch y'all later. Hope y'all have a blessed day. I'm out.